Hey guys, me and Alex are back with our next awesome box sent from a subscriber. Yeah, and this one was sent to us by Robert and Tim, and we're so excited about yeah. this because we've been emailing them. They emailed us to say, we want to send you some candy, and we've been having a bit of a back and forth. And so. we've been super excited to pick it up, and it's finally here, and we can finally get into it. So, yeah. should we have a look? Yeah, let's look into it. Woo. Oh, we got a little note. Do you want to read this out? Yes. Hey guys, we recently found your videos on YouTube and love your channel. They're very entertaining, especially the ones where you try snacks from other countries. I guess that's why you're sending us a box. We decided that although you have tried American snacks a few times, there's still a wide variety out there for you to sample. That's what we were saying the other day, wasn't yeah. it? Like There is obviously so much stuff out yeah. there that we've never had before. Because in our last box, which you can catch up on up there, we there were so many things that weren't duplicates, were they? Yeah, no, we there was literally like one or two. And we thought we'd already tried so many American mm. things, and people in the comments have said, you've almost tried everything now, but there is still so much left to try, isn't there? Yeah, I think there must be so many snacks yeah. and kind of like well, bars and... There does look to be some crisp chips in here. Oh, we love So chips. they decided to send us some of their favourites. That's mm. exciting. We may have gone overboard, so you might need to split the contents into two segments. Just watch the expiration dates on the cakes and chips. Oh, that's nice of them to mm. say. We feel like we might actually just have a super long video and just yeah. so it's in one so you guys can and all see it. And work all the way through. The bamboozled box of jelly beans is probably its own segment. That should be hilarious. That's awesome. We'll definitely do that on its own. Yeah. Enjoy. Hope you like our snacks as much as we do. Rob and Tim. P.S. Yeah, should I read this? Alex should take his shirt crossed out. Hat off more. He's such a cutie. <laughs> if you're ever in St. Louis and need a place to bunk, we'll be more than happy to entertain you. Guys, that is so kind of you. So kind yeah. of you. St. Louis, I've always wanted to visit there. If only we'd read this before, I could have taken my hat off, but now it's <laughs> yeah. on. I'll have hat hair. And you'll have hat yeah. hair, yeah. <laughs> Thank you so much, Rob and Tim. This box is so heavy and it looks absolutely full, so we're super excited yeah. to get in. And like they say in their letter, even if we do get duplicates, which I don't think we have, no. It's nice when people say it's what they like. Yeah. So it's like we're experiencing food through their yeah. eyes. Should we get in? Yeah, let's do it. Let's go. Okay. Ooh, 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 that looks good. Ooh, got that. Oh, well, oh, I know yeah. we like these. I don't know. I'm not sure about the crunchy like ones. Chips in here. Ruffles. We don't have ruffles, have we? Um, They're I so famous, I, like I think. I have had ruffles, but not necessarily in America, yeah, more in you Europe. Take five. Take five. I'll take. <laughs> I don't know if they've done this on purpose, but mm. there's lots of like chips on top, so maybe yeah. they know we start savoury. They, they know we like to start savoury. So savory. we've got a few chips in here. Should we get these out? Yeah. Okay. There's a poll in the corner. Go let us know which is your favourite out of yes. these four. Yes, that's such a good idea. And let us know if you've tried all of them in the comments down below. Right, should which we start one's left? Which first, left to right. Okay. I don't need to try these because I've tried them, but I'm going to because Cheetos are one of my favourite chips ever. I've only ever had the puffy Cheers. ones. I've never had the... Oh, that was cool. I've never had the crunchy one. They are good. I love the puffy ones and we always get the puffy ones, but I don't know why we never pick up the crunchies because they are delicious, aren't mm, they? So good. I love Cheetos. Mm. After you finish the bag, your fingers are really orange and then you get to enjoy them. <laughs> the powder. <laughs> okay, what is going then? These are a 10. These are a 10! I think out of all crisps ever, Cheetos, Cheetos. are probably my favourite. Right, 10 out of 10. Excellent. Thank you, Rob and Tim. Nacho cheese? Doritos. I wonder if these taste the same as ours. They smell different. Yeah, my water game today. <laughs> so you won't have to be getting it as long. Cheers. Once again, lots of like powder on it. What flavour is this? Nacho cheese. Mmm. Oh, it does taste like natural cheese. I always find Doritos really powdery there. Mm. These don't taste like our cheese. Like the flavour's good at first and then it just kind of like... Yeah, yeah, the flavour's best at first. It's a bit like the crisp first. equivalent of bubblegum. I don't know if it's just because I'm seeing the red bag, but they do have a slight heat to them. I don't think so. They're great. Very oh, nice. As they compare to the the, um, the Cheetos every night. They're a nine for me. Mm. Mm. I really like those. Mm. Right, Very should we hop delicious. onto the ruffles? Yes, definitely. I like the um, the packaging. Mm. Although, is it blue, white, and orange? It's black. Yeah, but it's not American. No. People should let us know down below. Ruffles, I've heard of so many times. Why are they so famous in America? Yeah. Mm. Wow. They're so good. They've got um, lots of powder on as well. I think I've tried Ruffles um, sour cream and chive, not cheddar and sour cream. 
The flavour on them is amazing. So delicious. That's what I love. They call them potato chips. Oh, potato chips. Mmm. Because in, instead of just biting through like a thin potato chip, the crinkle like gives it a bit more depth. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Miss my your mouth. Mm. Mm. Oh, these are divine. These are a 10 out of 10. Oh, these are a 10 out of 10. They're as good as the Cheetos. And then Funyuns. These almost seem a bit old school a bit, don't they? I wonder if these are quite a traditional bag. I think bag. they're quite traditional. What I love about the design of this bag is this little section here that looks like a cutout, like you're looking yeah, straight looking into, into the, the bag. bag. I swear there's like a TV or film reference to Funyuns. Oh. I just can't think what it is. Let me know well, if you know what it, it is down edit. below, yeah. Guaranteed fresh until printed date. Oh my word. I like onion rings. And I love onion rings. I love onion Cheers. ring crisps. Onion rings, not so much. Mm. Mm. Good crunch, good flavour. They mm. taste different to our onion rings. Almost, they are oniony. Almost like a, a quaver sort of feel. Mm. It's probably my least favourite out of them, so I'll probably say seven. I really like them, but out of these I'm going to give them an eight. I reckon if we tried them on their own without mm. those, it would have been much higher. Right, that was excellent. Great right chip round. Oh, so uh, these are the Bean Boozled, they're saying. This is probably its own episode. And I Would think love we should to do, do that, that as yeah. a challenge. Should we? Oh, these look like they might be savoury. Barnum's Animals Crackers. I reckon they're crack? like a biscuit. Oh, my word, look. Oh, you get a little thing to hold it. It's like a briefcase. Like taking a little briefcase to school. <laughs> oh, you get like a lion, a seal, a hippopotamus, a koala and an elephant. This is Nabisco, who did those wafers that we tried the oh, other yeah. yesterday. Oh, this is cool because you can reseal it afterwards. So it's got a um, little foil bag. Okay, so I wonder if these are sort of sweet. So I say crackers, but to me that looks like a biscuit. Yeah, cheers. I've got a lot of food. Mm. Very crunchy. Are they like lemon? I think so. Quite plain, but really nice. Mm. Very light lemony taste, I think. It doesn't necessarily say it's lemon, but it does have a little taste of that, doesn't it? Mm. Oh, good though. Great little snack, aren't they? Mm. I reckon these are probably more aimed at kids, mm. but I would never say no to like a little cracker. Yeah. But they're nice. They're just a plain, great with a cup of tea. Mm. Mm. I'll probably give them a seven. I'll give them a seven as well, yeah. Mm. It's got a little bit bashed in the post, but um, That's okay. it's still pretty full, pretty whole. Oatmeal cream pie or creme pie? Cream pie. I think it's cream. We always get caught out by that because when it's got meat on there, we're like, creme. This is a sandwich cookie from Little Debbie. Suggested retail price is 50 cents. And you love oatmeal raisin cookies, I don't you? I love oatmeal there. raisin cookies. There's like, that looks amazing, doesn't it? It's a bit it? like a um, cream egg. Wow. Mm. It's a lovely mm. chewy cookie. How'd they get it to be so chewy, even though it's in a packet? Oh. Mm. That's really nice. I was having something a bit you know, moist in the middle. Mm. Are there raisins in there? No. No, it's just a nightmare cream pie. Yeah, it's so chewy though. Mmm. Mmm. And the cookie is delicious. So good, isn't it? The cream's nice. A cream, sometimes a bit artificial tasting. Yeah. But nothing compared to a Twinkie. What are you giving that? I'm going to give it an 8. I'm giving it an 8 as well. I really like it, but there is better stuff. Mm hmm If we had this three times now, that will be the third time. So this is obviously quite popular yeah. or quite new because in the last three subscriber boxes we've had we've one. We've all had those. And we and love them. Yeah, so. and Dad absolutely loved that, so he's going to be so pleased. So this is awesome. We might as well put this to one side for now. I've always wanted to try Dove chocolate. Yeah. And they've given us two little ones, but should we just open one for yeah. now? So this is pretty much the same sort of writing and branding as our Galaxy here in the UK. Yeah. And I've always wanted to know, does it taste like our Galaxy? And now we will know. So this is the milk chocolate Silky Smooth Dove. And ours literally says Silky Smooth Galaxy, doesn't it? Does it? I this don't is like Galaxy, cute... so. Do you not? No. This is a really cute little bar. It's Only 100, 100 calorie, calorie bar. That's a really good idea. Oh my word. Oh, it's like this a little is mini so bar. cute. It's mini with little squares. May have the same branding, but it definitely, definitely doesn't, doesn't taste. taste like Galaxy. It's amazingly sweet. It's not like chocolate. Well, it is chocolatey, but it's more sweet than mm. chocolatey or creamy. Although the more I eat it, the aftertaste is a bit more like Galaxy. Mm. 
but I doubt they're, they might be the same company, but it's almost like- A different recipe. Cadbury's in America doesn't taste the same. Mm as our Cadbury's, and Cadbury's in Australia tasted slightly different, didn't it? Yeah. But that was I closer to the British. Because um, of people's different flavour palettes and stuff yeah. like that. I would say, in some ways, nicer than some Hershey's I've had. I'll probably give that a seven. Oh, nice than Hershey's, yeah. But, but I like the white one, didn't I? No, oh, the white one's good, yeah. I would give that a seven. I'd probably rather eat this cookie than that, so I'm going to give oh, really? it a seven. <laughs> so What's many people. Yeah. Do you want to try that? That's nutty, a nutty A nutty buddy. buddy. Now, I watch Trisha I've got Paytas. a nutty buddy. <laughs> I've got one too. I make videos with her. <laughs> your, your eyes. Now, Trisha Paytas. Um, has she got a nutty butt? Oh, this is Little Debbie as well. Oh, this, oh, yeah, Little Debbie. This is 50 cents as well. Oh, Mum's been busy. <laughs> um, Trisha Paytas said this is um, like a classic thing that she used to get when growing up. And like when her mum would have some like you know, get paid, then she would treat them with some nutty buddies. No wonder she's so tall. It says wafer bars with, with peanut, peanut butter. butter. I like the fact it's covered in chocolate. Oh wow. You want that bit? And look in there. So there's like wafer, peanut butter, wafer, peanut butter, wafer, peanut butter, wafer. Hmm. That is great. I knew you'd like that. Because we always forget how good wafer things mm. are. It's light, it's crunchy, it's peanut buttery. You peanut love? buttery. It's chocolatey. If it wasn't for the peanut butter, I'd love mm. that. I'm just not a big peanut butter fan. So. I thought you were getting into the peanuts. Oh. That more tastes like a Reese's peanut butter cup mm. peanut butter, doesn't it? That's good. What are you giving that? I think I'm going to give that a nine. Nine, yeah. really? Yeah, that's good. I'd rather have that than a cookie. I... Everything's based on the cookie now. <laughs> <laughs> the cookie sitting there. <laughs> what is Little Debbie's Little Debbie's? Okay, these are interesting. So these are simple, honest, delicious, nice. Circus peanuts, artificially flavoured, soft and chewy candy. So ah. I don't think they're nuts. These seem like our foam bananas in England. Well, I think that's what they are. They're like sweets that look like nuts, aren't they? Yeah. Oh, wow. Uh, I'm not sure they were that enlarged on the packet to show detail. <laughs> I no, think these are bigger. These are bigger and they're orange. I was not expecting Cheers. that. Oh, these are like those things. You know, just like chewy foam bananas. These are foam bananas, but peanuts. They even taste like banana, not nuts. Maybe it doesn't even taste like banana. Maybe because it's a banana, we always thought it tastes like banana. They're so good. These are delicious. They're foamy. They are delicious. If you know what a foam banana is, it's literally that shaped like a circus peanut. Delicious. Oh, good. Nine. <laughs> <laughs> I was going to go ten. I like it, but I'd give it a seven. Well, for you, I think this might be high okay. for you. So many people have said to try a Take 5 bar. Do you remember people saying in the comments? No. So this is a Take 5. We finally have one. The reason why it's Take 5 is because it's a five-layer bar. Milk chocolate, pretzels, peanut butter, caramel, and peanuts. These nuts! Ha <laughs> got him! This sounds amazing. From the pack, it kind of looks like a trail bar or something. Yeah. But I don't think it is. Oh, were you thinking this is more like a protein -y yeah. biscuit bar? Yeah. Apparently, no, this is like a, An a, like a chocolate, chocolate bar. bar. Oh, there's a tray. Is that? Oh, oh nice. it full on is a chocolate bar. I thought it was going to be open. Oh, oh two and there's ones. two. How lovely. Should we just share one? Yeah. Because I've. Oh, wow. Mm. I thought this was all going to be like open. Yeah, literally a pretzel on the bottom. Yeah. And it's not that's too peanut nice. buttery, no, is that's, it? No, I quite oh, like so that. You might like that. That pretzel's nice, mm. isn't it? Mmm. Not bad. Not too peanut buttery, which is why I like it. Yeah. I'll probably only but give just, that a seven though. Like for me, there's probably not enough peanut butter yeah, flavour. Yeah, you'd rather more. Wouldn't I'd it? like a bit more, but it's still nice. Really like that. I'll give that a seven. I'm gonna give that an eight. I'll give that a five, take five. <laughs> take five. So we've now got some candy things. We've got, oh, these are new. Ring Pops Tongue Painters. Color your tongue. We've got Pop Rocks, grape flavor, popping candy. Mm. And then they've put this little package together. So it's just obviously some things that you can get in multi-packs probably. Yeah. And they've just, just put thing. some in. So thank you for doing that, guys. Right, what do you want to try first? Should we paint on our tongues? Yeah, with the pop rocks. Yep. Oh, you actually get a few in here. Oh, oh that's word. cool. What flavour do you want to go for? Cherry Not explosion. Cherry, Purple berry punch. Not sure that's a real flavour. 
Blueberry Blast. Yes, please. Ooh. That actually fits on my finger. Oh, how funny. They're slightly, are these slightly smaller than usual ones, or are they Yeah, just... they do seem smaller, don't they? But I reckon it's because it's like Some a multi-pack. Multi -pack. <laughs> Which finger will this fit on of mine? <laughs> Only this one. Surprisingly, <laughs> that's quite big. You it's really, really can a tongue paint painter. your tongue. Doesn't that mean, though, it's just got loads of like food colour on it? Must do. The great thing is, you can just have this with you on the go mm. as you're hanging later. around. Um, ah! you're like, oh, I need a bit of flavour. <laughs> Although you pick it up and they'll be like <laughs> fluff all in there and yeah. a bit of a fly. <laughs> <laughs> flavour wise, that's quite good actually. Yeah, what good was your flavour flavor like? It was good flavour actually. I'm not sure what purple berries meant to be, but it was mm. like fruity and sweet and <laughs> I wonder how long tasty. That in there. I'll give that for for like child Kate, I'll give that like a nine. Yeah. For adult Alex, I'll give it a five. <laughs> <laughs> Real pop in action. Entertainment for your whole mouth. Oh I Great. love entertainment for my whole mouth. Great flavour. I hate it when only half my mouth's entertained. Do you want to put some in your hand? Yeah. Now, because these are actual, like, pop rocks, I wonder, like, how poppy they'll be. Oh, uh... <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> Whoa! So what are you meant to do with them? Just eat them, or do you meant yeah, to put just, them on stuff? They're, You're on I know you say what you meant to do with that, but kids love stuff like that. Mm. You know, like sherbet, you just eat yeah. sherbet, like what's the point of that? But mm. for popping candy, I'd give that a 10. I'd give that a five. No, but I'm saying like out of all the popping candy I've had, oh, that's right. like one of the most reactions I've yeah. ever had. But compared reacts. to all the other stuff, oh, I'm yeah. gonna give it a five. I'll because... give that a 10 for popping candy, but yeah, I'll give that a five because mm. it's, I'd much rather buy a bag I'd rather of have like a, a, a candy or something. These are called kits. They gave us two of everything, but I'm just giving us one. These are banana flavoured taffy. Mm. Oh, I love the little, um, you oh, get you, three little things. It looks like a little thing and then you get three inside. Mm. Oh yeah, it's really hard. And then we've got vanilla flavoured taffy and strawberry. Mm, couldn't we have had one of those? <laughs> I know, I didn't realise they were the same thing. <laughs> Not the biggest fan of that. I reckon I like strawberry more. Yeah, not massive fan of taffy. As I said in the last video, I'm not a big fan when I'm worried that I'm gonna break, break my teeth by eating something. So it kind of takes the enjoyment out of it for me. This is Chico stick, which kind of looks like a carrot, but it's not. <laughs> yeah, it it's crunchy look peanut good. butter and toasted coconut candy. Should we open now this? to me, that none of that shouts yum. To me, it's just the, the way it comes is strange. Yeah. Is it almost like that wafery thing again? Yeah. Is it nice? Yeah, it's just really crunchy. It's we strange. don't have anything like this. I know when we? you're like, why is it orange though? Mm. Oh, it's wow. like the it's like a cross between a sweet and That's nicer peanut than butter. I thought. That's nicer than that taffy. Mm. Not bad actually. I'll give it a six. I'll give that a six. It's got too. a good flavour. I tried bite this or do you not recommend it? It's more it? the texture that's weird. So like, why is it so small? Oh. Were you not meant to bite it? I don't that? think so. Ow. Are you taking your teeth out? I think so. Is it hard completely? Mm. I reckon it's like a gobstopper. I don't know how you bit through that. I do not know. Like by my crooked teeth. Mmm. Mm. That's nice. That's good. That's got really good lemon Really good flavor. lemon flavour. We could get a seven. Okay, we've done the first level. Ooh, levels, 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 levels. We do oh. have a duplicate. This is this is a king size king one. Size. Which you'll be happy about because you love yeah. this. So this is a whatchamacallit. We tried it in the last video, made with chocolate, peanut flavoured crisp and caramel. Yeah, and I loved everything about it. To have a king size. So, king size, yeah. So we're not gonna try this right now. We're gonna keep Robert it fresh. And Tim. We're gonna keep it fresh and um, I'm gonna enjoy this later. So thanks guys That'd for that. So Look at this little Ziploc bag. So we have juicy fruits, which I love juicy fruits. We actually get them here, don't we? So should I we- I don't know. <laughs> should we have a little chew of each? Yeah. Oh, they've given us two fruits. Dry. Oh, fruit these are Wrigley's. Oh, wow, look. Maybe oh, that's why you've given us two, because you get five different flavours. This is a really cool concept for a chewing gum, don't you think? Yeah. Five different flavours, and it says them on the back. Wet and wild melon, cherry, lemon, orange, peach smash gum. Yeah, and what one did you want out of that? Ooh. Oh, I love the smell of juicy fruits. That's they smell strong. Yeah. Take my strong. Out of those that I said, what do you want to try, Al? Uh, wet and wild, watermelon. Wet and watermelon. And I love that the the green sweet is quite often watermelon in America. 
Ooh, it comes in a little bit of paper. Oh, and is that the gum literally there? No, oh. there's, it's inside again. Oh my word. Oh, it's not green. Oh my that word. That was just the ends of the thing. That's a tattoo. Is that a tattoo? What is this? What is this? What's yours this, Cara? Yeah. Oh no, my one was like orangey, yellowy. Okay. Uh, yeah. okay. Yeah. Maybe we'll just that on. Oh. <laughs> oh, it's kind of one. <laughs> Maybe I didn't read it properly. I think we didn't do it very well. Oh, press family for 15 seconds, do not rub. Now we are. Okay. That's got good flavour. Mm. I like that. I like that. I love this little zip bag as well. That was really good. Um, in terms of chewing gum, I think <coughs> I'll give that like an eight. Yeah, I'll That's give that good. an eight. It's delicious. The flavour. Now we have juicy fruits, but this says now longer lasting. And have you even what had juicy fruits? What flavour is juicy fruits? I can't remember. I think it's all. I can't think. I think it's just like fruity. Smells really strong. Mm. Quite firm to start though. Yeah. Isn't it? Mm. Right, I don't know what that flavour is. It's just like a generic fruitiness. Mm, it's mm. delicious. Yeah, it's really good actually. And it says now longer lasting. Mm. That's got a good flavour. Mm -hmm. Probably give that an eight as well on the flavour. Oh, good that. Maybe an eight and a half, slightly. Mm. Although that one's got. Although a Although it says now longer lasting, but. I feel like this is already fading. Really? Might not. And I feel like that was lasted just as long. Hmm. I could be wrong. Okay, so the rest of this layer all looks to be like chocolate. Oh, it looks good. Although that looks like popcorn. Okay. Cracker Jack. New prize inside. Cracker Jack, the original. Popcorn enlarged to show texture. They all say that, don't they? Caramel coated popcorn and peanuts. Oh, that's cool. Blip a surprise. Oh, there's one. You would not be anyone's friend at the cinema no. trying to get these out, would you? Here you go, Kate, I got you too. Thank you. The flavour is really great. Also, though. you don't get many in a pack, do you? No. And what's that prize in there? Ooh, what's the prize inside? Is it a tattoo? Oh, is it a tattoo? It says, blip a surprise, lift and oh, peel. Oh, wow. Oh, you do get a sticker. How to blip a surprise. Download the free blip flipper app, aim and frame your prize inside, a fun mm. digital experience. And the sticker! I really like those. Do you? I'll probably give them a nine. Really? Yeah. I'll give them an eight. The toffee flavor was nice. I didn't really try mm. any peanuts, but these are finally Reese's Pieces! Ooh. So in our video, we kept saying Reese's Pieces instead of Reese's Peanut Butter Cups, and here we are finally trying them. Yeah, and if you want to see that video, you can click up there. I wonder if this is why they sent them. Maybe. Because, so this is Reese's Pieces. Peanut butter candy in a crunchy shell. Now we did try these in a peanut butter yeah. cup, but now we're getting to try them on their We've own. We've never had pieces on their own, Full only the within a peanut butter cup. Mm. Yum. So yeah. And I'm not a big peanut butter fan. The candy shell is delicious. Because for, remember for a while, I was obsessed with peanut butter M&Ms. Yeah, these taste like that, don't they? I think these might be better. Oh, Although really? peanut butter M&Ms oh, are yeah, slightly these bigger, are better, yeah. you get a little bit more inside, which is the only thing going for them, but I prefer these. It's quite nice having mm. them all small though. Mm. I used to be a big fan of peanut butter M&Ms as well. These are really nice. I'm surprised no one sent us peanut butter M&Ms. They were actually really nice. I'm giving those an eight. I'm giving those a 10. I thought you would. Mm. We've got a Heath bar. And this is king size and there are two bars in here. And this is milk chocolate English toffee bar. Oh. I wonder what that means. And this is another one of those American things that's got really classic design. It's like Lucky they've ball. never updated their packaging. Yeah. Oh, it's part of Hershey's. Oh, really? Oh, it's distributed by Hershey's. Oh, wow. And does Ooh, it snap? Oh, do you reckon this is like a chomp? Oh, no, it's got more Snaps. of a snap to it. Toffee is more um, like a crunchy toffee, isn't it? Mmm. Is there something else in there? Nice. That is great. You know what that's kind of like? Yeah. Kind of like a dime bar. It's not solid it in the middle, is it? A dime bar? Yeah. Or it is. Mm -hmm. it's got a crunch. That's really nice. That's so good. I'm giving that a nine. Oh yeah. Mm -hmm. I'll probably give that an eight. Didn't think you'd go so high on that. Hershey's Extra Large Symphony Bar. Creamy milk chocolate, almonds and toffee chips. And this is an XL bar. I wonder if this will be like classic Hershey's chocolate or because it's symphony, it's slightly better. Yeah, maybe because it the says symphony, creamy just the, milk chocolate. Yeah, just the symphony of flavours. Oh, maybe. Oh, actually, didn't someone comment saying the, the symphony bars were better because they are more creamy? Oh, really? 
Whereas in American chocolate, I don't think it's that They're creamy. creamy no. So what's, what's in here? Sorry, to. toffee and almonds. Almonds and toffee chips. Yeah, so a bit so like that. I wonder that. if it's kind of toffee like that. Yeah. Although Maybe I don't think it's going to be a full centre. Yeah. The only thing I do like about Hershey's is that, like the They've little got... shape of them. It's like a little stamp. The toffee pieces in there are quite nice, but is that Hershey chocolate that mm. I don't like? Yeah, I still can't get over the chocolate. It does a good job to distract you though, doesn't it? <laughs> yeah. Mm. It's just, yeah, I'm not a fan of Hershey's milk chocolate. Okay, what are you giving that? A six. I'm giving that a six as well. Moving on to Ghirardelli, I can hold that. <laughs> Ghirardelli, I'm pretty Moving sure. Moving on to Ghirardelli. In America, I've used Ghirardelli baking, you know, chocolate chips oh, baking in baking chocolate, quite yeah. a lot. Um, I don't know if it's necessarily baking chocolate or they have a baking chocolate brand, but yeah. always in the cooking aisle, it had these chips in. Isn't it because they come in chips, that's why you got yeah, it? Yeah, maybe, because I think these are good quality chocolate. Mm. This is dark chocolate sea salt caramel. Experience a delicious combination of rich, slow-melting dark chocolate and luscious buttery caramel filling enhanced by a touch of sea salt. For you, this is like perfect, This is isn't the it? dream, yeah. In San Francisco, Ooh. there's a whole Ghirardelli place, isn't there? Shop. Because I think, is it from San Francisco? Whoa, Ooh, those pieces. pieces are massive. Wow, they do look fancy, don't they? Mm -hmm. Got like the logo on. Do you want to get a closer look? Wow, we got the logo. No, it's, I don't think it's so dark. It's not like the dark chocolate oh, I have, oh. but it literally Caramel melts beer. in your mouth. It's not mm. too dark, is it? No. Mm. That is so rich. Yeah, really rich, actually. It's so it's really luscious dark. filling. I think I could only eat one piece of that. I don't time. like dark chocolate. It, that's an okay dark chocolate, isn't it? Mm. It's not too bitter, but you get a bit of a bitter aftertaste. The caramel is amazing in there, and it's really salted, isn't it? Yeah. What would you give that? I would give that, I think that's a 10. Really? Yeah. I don't think I could eat a lot of it, but it's so good. I'm going to give that a seven and a half, just mm. because I don't really like dark chocolate, but the caramel inside is really but nice. The dark chocolate's so thin, and there's so much caramel. Yeah, but it's that's like for it doesn't you. Matter. Whereas, like, you've got the border as well as the mm. chocolate. I think we're on to our last level, and actually, there is one more duplicate. Bit old honey. Oh, they were great, weren't they? These were really nice. Oh dear. What's wrong with what, these again? Today? I know. Real honey and almond bits blended into delicious taffy. Oh yes, that's what it was. We tried these in our last box. Mm. They were okay. Oh no, they were nice. I thought we liked them. They were just them, a bit we? hard. I think we need to like soften them up a bit. Ooh. Have we tried these or was it a different brand? Turtles. Turtles. I don't think we've ever tried turtles. But was it me? We tried something and I said, oh, there's a dessert and that people make on Pinterest in America called turtles. Oh, yeah. And it's pretzels, caramel oh, and yeah. thingy. But this is original pecan milk chocolate with creamy caramel and premium pieces. Mm. These little turtles. Why do they get called turtles? They, maybe because they look like a little shell. Actually, yeah, they look like they're hiding in their shell. Hmm. Ooh. Let me try something Filled, a bit like it? that in the last video. The um, blueberry things. Mm. They like pecan mm. in America, don't they? Mm. Pecan pies. They like peeking around the corner, seeing what <laughs> they're doing. I'm not the biggest pe pecan fan. I don't even. I guess if you don't like nuts so much, you do notice it. But to me, I can't taste you can't pecans. Taste the difference. That's good though. I love how chewy it is. I'll probably give that a six. Mm. I'll give that an eight. Really like that. Mm. Bottle caps. A few people have commented saying try these. Have you heard of I these? Feel, yeah, I've heard of these oh. before. Well, I Googled it when someone said about trying bottle caps, and then I remember Millie, our cousin, I think she tried these once in America. But I reckon these are like mm. a... Oh, yeah. I feel like I do remember her having these. Yeah. I reckon I remember some oh, of them like being that, like that. cola can... flavour. Oh, hold on, it says at the front. Root beer, cherry, grape, cola, orange. So these are like the flavour of... Mm. I thought they'd actually be like the shape of a bottle cap. Mm, I thought so, but if you look you at like them, they them are, but mini. You put them on top of your bottle and then you chew it and you have a drink. Mm. These mm. are like um, Love Hearts. That orange is delicious. If you've tried Love Hearts, it's yeah, got that, like that texture. Sherbet. It's a crunch and then it kind of breaks up into a powdery sherbet. Mm. I actually like them. I'll give them an eight. You're not a big fan of no, these, are you? I'll give them a six, probably. 
Should we try sugar babies? Yeah. Because these look real cool, don't they? Yeah, these and they look... come in a box again. They come in a box, they're called sugar babies, delicious candy coated milk caramels. Mm. These look quite traditional to America, don't you think? Yeah, and I've never, again, I've never seen these before. Yeah. You could always use these as a musical instrument. Yeah. Not musical instrument, maybe percussion. Big fish, little fish, cardboard box. Big fish, little fish, little fish cardboard box. Right, here we go. Ooh, they're little. Whoa. You can have some of these. share some of those. It says candy coated, but to me, that just looks like caramel. Doesn't it? Yeah, they don't. But I wonder if they coloured it. Mmm. Oh, chewy. That's an interesting texture and mm. flavour. Mmm. I can't really um, taste the candy coating. Mmm. What I can taste is caramel. And that's really nice. Yeah, are caramelly. You know what they're a bit like for me, though? Um, candy corn? Is they're just kind of like quite sugary and chewy. They're delicious. I'm not so sold. Are you not? No. They're a nine. I think they're a six. They taste good, but I would never eat them. I keep wanting to call them sugar daddies. A sugar <laughs> <laughs> No, this is what I got happens. Your bag, sugar daddies. This is what happens when you have a sugar daddy and you have babies. <laughs> <laughs> sugar, baby. sugar babies. Can we try a nutter butter? Because yes. I'm always saying nutter butter and I didn't realise it was a thing. Love the packaging. Guess what? There's what? a tray. Guess what? They look like peanuts. Yeah. Another butter. Peanut butter sandwich cookies. Oh, that sounds exciting. Oh, wow. I've seen these. <laughs> People like decorate things with these. Half. Yeah. Look That's cool. Oh, they do smell nutty. Just peanut butter. I like how they're <laughs> shaped like a peanut. <laughs> like a monkey nut. A no? monkey nut, yeah. You know my thoughts on peanut butter. Yeah. So. <laughs> what are you giving that? I'm going to give that a seven. Oh, really? Mm. I just think there's better peanutty things out there. Yeah. I like the sandwich biscuit and I like, you know, it's that kind of Oreo thing of having a bit of biscuit on either mm -hmm. side and the bit of cream in the middle, which is the peanut butter. Yeah. I like that, but I just think there's better peanut things yeah. out there. Yeah, and I'm pretty sure like Rob and Tim, if they're going to pick something peanut buttery, they wouldn't jump to these first, probably. No, but the thing is, they would be they're great just... as a peanut butter style biscuit if you're having a cup yeah. of tea. You might not, if you're having a cup of tea, have a Reese's peanut butter yeah. cup. No. But you might oh, have yeah, a nut like butter. Oh yeah, because that's a candy in a biscuit. Yeah, true. I really Jump want to try zero. this. Yeah. This is so heavy. Can you guess what this is at all? Um, it's a zero calorie, um, no guilt <clears throat> So this is a zero candy bar, king size, caramel, peanut and almond nougat. Nougat. Covered with white fudge. Oh, is this going to be a fudge. white chocolate bar thing? It's white. Is it? This is awesome. Oh, wow. 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 We have nothing like this. I don't think I've ever seen anything like this. It almost looks from the outside like a white Mars bar. Yeah, that does look good. And where's the peanuts and the mm. stuffs? Oh, like in there. In there. Mmm. Mm. That is strange, because as you're eating it, it's like, it's a white Mars bar, but it's different, very I've different. I've never tried anything like this. Mm. Yeah, like, I mean the white fudge around the mm. edge. The inside tastes like, in the Amer America, a Milky Way, mm. Mars bar in the UK. Yeah. Oh no, but I was thinking, that nougat -y bit tastes more like a Milky Way in England. Oh. And uh, Three Musketeer. Three Musketeer bar. Oh yeah, Three Musketeer. Mm. It almost tastes Marzi Panny. Mmm. That's in a way, doesn't it? I think that's the white fudge. Ooh. That's really nice. I actually like that. I'm giving that an eight and a half. In some ways, I wish it was covered in white chocolate rather than white fudge. But if you notice, they don't actually have a lot of white chocolate in America. I'm going to have to give that, although I liked it and it was quite interesting, I'm going to have to give it a seven because I think there was... A bit of a weird flavour. A bit of a strange, yeah. yeah. But I might get used to it, and then I'd really well, like it. Well, add about five bites, you had Did one. You? Yeah. <laughs> because these are minty, Rob and Tim have put them in a bag within a bag so they don't contaminate anything else. Guys, you thought of everything. You are good. Now, we have actually tried Junior Mints. They were the smallest little pack yeah, it was like in a like one of our pack. first American Candy videos. I don't like mint chocolate, but I did kind of like these. I think I spat them out in the Because they're kind of I? soft, aren't they? They're like... They're like a real soft center. It's like in an after eight. It's that kind of... What do you call it? Like a cream, creamy kind of oh, mint. Oh, yeah, like a creamy milk. Oh, creamy mints in pure chocolate. There you so go. we'll keep these closed and enjoy these later. Yeah. Okay, so we do have Starburst in England. And what's interesting is they're in a foil pack. Are they in a foil pack oh, here now? No, they're not. They're in like a plastic pack. Even though pack. they're wrapped up. 
So the flavours so here. So which is cherry? I want to try cherry. Cherry is, I'm red. guessing, red. I'm going to give cherry a try. Orange, strawberry and lemon. Now you only have four flavours in the American one. However, they do have a lot more packs. Where's strawberry there? Oh, They're pink. pink. Although they do have a lot more packs that are different, different flavours. Like wild berry I've seen. Mm. How's That's cherry? Good, the cherry one. I'll try cherry because we don't have cherry mm. in England. Mm. We started getting more limited edition um, Starburst over here. But... Almost a, a different texture to ours. Mm. These are chewier. Definitely chewier. What are we giving them? An eight. I do like them. I'm gonna give them a nine. That was incredible. So We've good. We've just tried so many things. Thank Me and you Alex. so much, Robert and Tim. We loved it, honestly. Yeah. So much. You good put stuff. so much thought into there, and thank you for putting like the mints in a different bag as well, and putting them in the layers. So thank you so much for taking the time and the effort to put that box together and send it to us. Yeah, and to say thank you, we're gonna send you one of our ultimate candy Woo! boxes. Um, and we're going to fill that with all our favourite candies and yeah. snacks. And we so. hope you like them. And we can hopefully carry on emailing and let us know what you think to our candy. Yeah. And uh, if anyone at home would like to buy one of those boxes as well, you can click the link up there or in the description down there. Did you enjoy that? Yeah, I enjoyed it. Did you? I definitely enjoyed that. <laughs> I'm feeling it now, though. <laughs> yeah, I'm about to crash hard. <laughs> <laughs> we hope you guys enjoyed that and we'll see you very soon. Bye, guys. See ya.